guys, Carly from Carly's KBs again, and I wanted to first show off my new Lancaria guinea pig. Isn't she beautiful? This is Mimosa. She's a self lilac Lancaria, about three months old. She is bred by my friend. So if you're looking for Lancaria guinea pigs, check out True Caviary in Jacksonville, Florida. So anyway, I get a lot of questions about haircuts for the guinea pigs because now I own all but one long hair guinea pig. So they do need trims and it gets hot here. So we trim them almost like a buzz cut in the summertime so that they're not too hot. But um, just I'll compile all of the videos that I have of me doing haircuts, but I don't use buzzers. I've tried, they don't like it very much. And the scissors are actually the easiest way to go about doing it in my opinion so that's all I need for haircuts and actually I only do like major haircuts like once or twice a year I don't find that it's needed because as long as their hair is nice and I keep them on the longer end because I just like it um she actually hasn't had a haircut other than a bum trim and that's kind of the main thing that I cut on them so I always keep their rear end super short because I don't like them to get wet and yucky and I don't think anybody really does. But as far as like their main fluff, I let it be fluffy. With the Lancaria and the Peruvians, I always trim so that they can see because there's a lot of times their hair will kind of flop and cover their eyes like that. So, um, but a lot of times it gets dirty when it drags on the floor. So kind of just a snip snip along the edge here and then keeping it here. How I do their bellies is I usually will put them against me and snip snip just like that. And they're usually pretty calm as long as you have them pushed against you like this. If you have them kind of in free air and you can already see she, when I back up, she doesn't like that as much. So um, I also, this is a five gallon bucket that she's sitting on. I keep them on some sort of platform, helps my back for one. And it also, oh, you're gonna sing. That's really nice. Um, it also keeps them from going where anywhere. They don't like to jump off of high things. So it kind of keeps them from running away from you. If you do it on the ground or on a table, they will kind of scatter and run away from you. So as long as they kind of feel protected, they do pretty well. So. I'm just gonna put all the videos I have of me cutting guinea pig hair on here so you can just watch it. But that's kind of the basics of it. It's not too hard. I like long hair guinea pigs so the haircuts don't bother me. Um, but for these ones especially, the coarser haired guinea pigs like Lancaria and Texel are easier to cut and I kind of just grab a lock and snip it off. That's it. So, enjoy.